Hey everyone, Josh here. Um, we're starting again on our V10 project um, after a few month break. The engine's coming out and I don't have a hoist as you can see, so it is coming out on a skid and it's coming out the front, so that's why we have the front clip off here. Um, so this video is going to be part one of three or four, depending on how lengthy they get. Um, this first one is getting it kind of prepped and ready to slide out the front. Um, there'll be a video on everything to get the engine ready to go and slide out and then possibly another video of it coming out and what I use to slide it out. Um, so yeah, let's get to uh, taking the front clip off. has got some wiring in there for fog lights and proximity sensors and stuff. So it's got one connector on the passenger side and also for the wipers, which mine have been plugged. As you can see, the bumper, everything comes nicely to the side here. And then everything else is all ran in there. So it's ideal to pop that off before you pop the bumper off. So uh, unplug that and away you go. So I didn't get a real uh, close up on all the different connections to do before this ends up on the ground. So we'll just do it a quick once over. Um, you've got your headlight bucket connector, I guess. I don't know what you'd call it. But so your headlight slides out of here and out. So this is your connector that you need to undo. So that's just in the fender well. Um, you've got or one on both sides. Same thing with this, which is I assume is an airbag sensor. So there's one there and one on the other side. Um, as far as connections over here, you've got your air, cold air intake, um, intercooler connection, along with one down there, lower rad hose, the tranny cooler, um, another coolant cooler of some sort, your upper rad hose, which I just undid from the housing there. Um, the other intercooler connectors, your other air box connector. Um, that's the other coolant cool, cooler of some sort. Uh, power steering cooler as well as AC lines. Um, th that AC connector is a bit of a pain to kind of reach up into. Um, and then same thing, so you got your headlight connector. That's in there. You've got this one, which does all of your, which I'm not sure what that did. That's your, oh, for your harness for your horn, um, temp sensor and your hood latch sensor. 
Um, there's also your hood latch cable, which I just kind of unbolted and moved it down to undo it. It's kind of hard to see, but up in there, it just kind of pops off. And then, yeah, same thing for this side. You've got another airbag sensor you can just slip over the intercooler. And, uh, yeah, that's about it.